Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy BLS and yep, we're doing a little video. I have something I want to talk about and it's so it's kind of important that I don't need a gameplay behind it. I know some people like these kind of videos. Uh, I got a, quite a bit of good feedback when I did like a vlog type of rant. This really is not a rant. My videos like this aren't rants, but if you're going to consider this a rant, this is probably my last rant because I think I found a solution to everything. Okay, so many people just like... I don't really know. First first and foremost, I just want to thank you guys for the feedback on this week's video. I think I dropped 1K likes on my first trick shot, and I dropped like, n you know, a couple hundred likes on my uh, my next, or it was my phase one mini talk. I've been, uh, you know, every day I, you know, search up music, I search up, you know, I look at the, the videos that I'm subscribed to, like, I have like the... Uh, my subs the people I'm subscribed to, I look at it and see if I have any the, any of their videos. You know, Obey Scares, he's been making videos about FaZe, been watching that. Speaking of FaZe, change is happening right now. Change is happening in the community. It's crazy, but at the same time, it's it's kind of good. It's good that it's changing, but it's crazy. They're dropping a bunch of people. Gwit is just disappeared. I, I think change is good. Change is, uh, change is usually good if you do it in the right way. I think, I mean, obviously, uh, when you watch like uh, Banks or Seabass or Apex or Rain, they always say Phase is going to Phase 2015 is going to be their year, and it, it's getting ready to hit, you know, 2015. And I, you know, I'm anxious to see what they have in store for us. And you know, that'd be even crazier if I could be a part of it. Never know. I'm gonna keep grinding for Phase One. Keep supporting me. But like your guys' support has been awesome, and uh, you know this is just this is just the knockout. This is this is the icing on the cake for everything that I've been trying to explain for the past couple of vlogs and everything. And you know this just makes so much sense because you know coming from me, it probably sounds retarded, and you know it's easy to pick out my flaws uh, or, or the inaccurate things that I say. But I looked at this video from Logic, and if you guys know who know, if you guys don't know who Logic is, Logic is a huge, huge artist. He just came out with an album. It's called Under Pressure. It's super dope. I've listened to it probably, you know, the whole album. When I think I stayed up for like three hours and listened to the whole album a couple times, and uh, you know, I have my favorite songs on there: Bounce, Nicki, uh, Soul Food. You know, I have those. I have those. You know, top notch songs that I listen to every day, but. Logic is such an icon now that a lot of people might listen to him more than they listen to me. Obviously, because I'm this, and Logic is, you know, huge, and everybody knows who Logic is now, you know. He's been making, he, he has a couple songs that Phases used, and he's, uh, he's a really dope artist, and, you know, I look up to him, you know, not, not just musically, because, like, I do make music. I don't look, at, look up to him just for music, but I look up to him as a person, you know. He's been through a lot, and he has great stories to tell. And I think that, you know, the stories that he tell can help you if you if you use them in the right way. But what I want to get to is I was watching this video of him on on a um on an interview, and a lot of you might just think this is stupid. And if you think this is stupid, you know, I just don't. I really don't care. But he he really just talks about the kind of shit that I'm dealing with right now and it hit it struck me pretty well because I was like damn dude maybe people will actually listen to this and I was trying to see how I could affiliate that video with mine and I said you know what I ain't even gonna copy what he said I ain't even going to do any of that I'm just gonna legitly rip the video straight off of YouTube and I'm gonna put it in this video and I'm gonna show you guys he literally makes so much sense and uh you know like like he said you know people people even you know that's just how this is the era we live in. People hate, people love, and what he says here is mostly you know music related. I want you to try to be a little bit creative and make it you know into my situation. He says, um, you know, he's a musical student. He's all that. Just think of it not music. Think of it as like YouTube, Xbox, Call of Duty. I just want you to think of that. And it's really crazy how he says, like, all this stuff. Like, he says, like, he can go into a chat room and these people have the opportunity to, you know, to chat with him and shit. But instead, they're telling him to kill himself, that he's a fucking faggot. Stuff like that. Or, um, you know, he, he also says, like, the, the, uh, the criticizer. Like, he talks about the people who criticize his work. You know, they could be like, well, you know, I like this and I like that. And that didn't fit with that. Like, you guys are sometimes like, you know, I really like the clips. I like the edit, but the song just sucked ass. Or, you know, the clips are the clips were decent. The song was super awesome. But the edit, did you even, like, try to do anything besides syncing? Like, that's what I'm talking about. But he talks about that and hits, hits really good points on, 
on different things and you know this is probably a really dumb video to upload but I really just I'm done with it I'm done with everything man I, I'm I found out what I want to do and you know I'm gonna keep continue to try to, try to join phase and I hope this f video hits you in the right way if that makes any sense I don't want it to uh, be a negative it's a it's a positive message and it's just you know a lot of people are saying why does BLS get hate why does BLS get hate this is the answer this video is the answer this video I don't know and uh, like I said, like I said, I'm sorry for this vlog shit. I would take my GoPro outside, but it's about uh, 30 degrees. I ain't going outside in that weather. But um, yeah, you know, change is happening, and I'm I'm actually happy for it. I can't wait to see how uh, you know top 50 change or turns out. Who gets recruited af off of the uh, top 50, and then uh, what members are actually getting booted out out of phase, and now that kind of brings up a little thing for me is they're booting people out are they going to recruit people back in that's the question but you know a lot of things are actually going to change and you know especially with the halo thing that just came out just i'm just asking you guys give it a chance you know it, it's everything just needs to you need to go and you, you need to have everything with an open mind everything you need to go into everything with an open mind like like right now, you need to have an open mind of what FaZe is uploading with Halo. They could have something big. Also, Halo competitive, you know, that's another thing. You know, they always go to MOG events for Call of Duty. Maybe, you know, that starts happening for Halo. You just give it just give it a chance. Have an open mind about it. But, yeah, I'm done talking. Watch this video. If you have any questions, you know, you guys know what my Twitter is. And, um, like I said, thank you for all the support for all my past videos. And, uh... You know, if you guys have any video suggestions for Advanced Warfare, let me know. I don't want to do commentaries every day. And, you know, I want to upload every day, but I just don't know what to upload. I don't want to upload mini tosses every day because, I mean, I could do mini tosses every day, but I only hit like 5 to 10 clips a day. So they would be short, short, short mini tosses. And I don't want to do that. Um, but, like, on the weekends, I could probably do day tosses. Those aren't bad. But just let me know what you guys want to see. And, uh,. Yeah, guys, this has been your boy VLS. Thank you for all your support recently, and I will see you guys later. Peace out. It's fun, man. It's, it's fun how things work. It's funny. You can't win. Like, you just, you can't win with people. You know what I mean? It's, um, I don't, I, I don't, I don't know. It's no matter what you do, you can't win. People will hate you. People will love you. Uh, I love this site. The funny thing is I'm not in the forums. I'm always on lyrics. Like, I always just go to, go to, go to do lyrics. And, um... Rap Genius had some really amazing people that love and care about this site. And there's also some really ignorant ass fucking people. But that's like the internet. That's, that's the funny thing. I remember I came in on a chat one time and I was like, I'm going to have some fun. Cause yeah, I, yeah, I was like, I'm going to have some fun and just go in and be like, say what's up to people. And I'm sure they're going to be assholes to me because that's where we live. We live, we live in an era where it's like, all right. <laughs> I, here's a rapper, whether I like him or not, here's somebody who I could actually have the opportunity to ask questions, whether I like him or not, and just get to know who he is personally. Here's this dude who's just showing me, he's just like a regular dude, like, hey, what's up, let's talk about hip hop. And then I'm gonna be like, fuck you asshole, or you suck, or kill yourself, or da da da. So I'm like, all right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fuck with y'all back, I'm gonna have a good time, you know what I mean? And somebody's like, you know, do you believe that if one door opens, you know, or shuts, a window opens, and I'm like, I believe you should jump out the window. <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm just an asshole. Like, it's funny. I'm just kidding. Like, if you're going to be a dickhead to me, I'm going to playfully joke back. But I don't think any, I think, you know, a lot of those people are like 14-year-old kids on Xbox. So, like, legit. Like, like no, like, grown human being would just, oh, you fucking, I hate this person, or, you know, Jay-Z sucks, and Logic's whack, and 2 chains and, like, no. I think, I think a real, like, grown human being is going to sit down and have incredible conversations about hip-hop and about music. And that's why, that's why I only go and, like, check my lyrics every now and again to make sure that they're right. And then every once in a while, I'm surprised, like, that I saw that forum. There was just this random forum. And I replied. I didn't think anybody was really going to see it, and they did, and it was amazing. But that's why I love my fans so much, because my message is always peace, love, and positivity. And those motherfuckers will be like, here's why I don't like the song. I don't like the song because, um, you know, like, his raps were okay. 
Uh, I get where he was coming from, but it was just something about the snare. It just it just didn't hit right. Or uh, actually, the beat was amazing, but just where he was going with it, it kind of felt like he had me, but he didn't. But honestly, before I before I, I give you my full judgment, I'm gonna give it I'm gonna give it some more spins. I'm gonna give it some more listens. And this is them talking about any artist. Okay, and then you have the other people who are that's like, constructive that's legit, right? And then you have other people, and this isn't Rap Gene, I'm not shitting on Rap Gene, Rap Gene is awesome, but I'm talking about the internet. Oh, hell yeah. And then you have, yeah, and then you have the other people who are like, yeah, fuck that dude, his face looks soft, I hate him. And they're, and, and they're like, what are you talking about? Have you even, like anybody, I'm not talking about me, I'm talking about any rapper. And like, yeah, fuck that dude. And they're like, have you even listened to him? I didn't even gotta listen to him, he's whack. What? That's like so funny. <laughs> That's Deep so internet. funny, man. Like, I'm a student of hip hop, bro. I can't tell you how many bad hip hop albums I've listened to that were horrible. From the golden era to today, out of respect. Because, like, people nowadays, they look for something to hate. When hip hop was built and formed upon looking for something to love.